All right, let's head into Toys R Us. Uh, Forty two ninety nine. Oh my God, crazy prices. Luke Skywalker is still fifty nine ninety nine for this broken pack. Oh man, all these peg warmers. Zerg. And somebody stole a coin. You. Oh, you looks like one your big giant turd. <laughs> I want to give a huge shout out to all my Patreon and channel member supporters. RyRakCan33, Old IT Guy, Princess Kagali, John Joker, Michael Traverso, Christopher Herndon, Snell World, Thomas Meyer, Budrick Porter, and Joseph Michaels. Thank you for all your support, everybody. It really means a lot to me and really does help the channel to keep going. All right, guys. I uh, heard some new Marvel Legends might be showing up here at Toys R Us. So I'm over here pickering and we're going to check it out. Wish me luck. All right, let's head into Toys R Us. All right, so over here by the Star Wars section, we don't seem... No, there seems to be a sale. Mini Star Wars Lego build with any Star Wars purchase of $25 more before taxes. Hmm. It's free. Okay. Cool. Don't know if I'll be buying anything, though. Carbon Freezing Chamber, definitely not. Not the... Uh, unfortunately, not Tentive 4, even though that's a really great play set. Uh, 37 for 99 for that. Man, the... Mission Fleet build up Bad Batch. Man, you gotta be kidding me. Thirty-four ninety-nine for the Defend the Child. Yeah, nothing else we've seen here before that we haven't seen here before. Thirty-six ninety-nine for Antok Merrick. I mean, it's not terrible, but it's not great. Well, actually, it's not that bad. Still, I'd rather play it less. I guess it is what it is. Grogu's down to thirty-four thirty-seven. Animated Grogu's down to eighty-three ninety-seven from one hundred nineteen. That's actually a really good price. Yeah, not much else that we haven't seen, unfortunately. Oh, they have all the droids figures back in stock. C-3PO, C-3PO. I stand corrected, it's just C-3PO. Okay, still, not bad. Scout Trooper, Shadow Trooper, Grief Karga, Lando. Yeah, all the other suspects. It's Rekka. Good old Rekka. Seriously, one of the best characters. Lando... Cheer with him way. Uh, Forty-two ninety-nine. Oh my God! Crazy prices. Uh, Maze Malbus. This is the crazy one, man. Like, short trooper. Just crazy amounts. Of, just crazy prices. Garen A. Uh, Galen Airzo. Sorry. K two S O. Thirty-seven ninety-nine. Thirty-nine ninety-nine. Jeez Louise. Cheer with M way. Forty bucks. Like, I don't get it, man. I seriously don't. It's still gin for forty two ninety nine. Like what is going on? Crazy. Those are like deluxe prices. Tons of Boca Tons, tons of Luke Skywalkers. Oh hello. It's that new mud muddy muddy mando. <laughs> the muddy mando. Yeah, it's kinda weird. It's kinda cool. Well, you know, I don't I don't really mind it. It's mostly just paint deco all over the place. No real uh, sculpting details uh, or extras or anything like that. Grogu's closing his eyes. It's kind of cute. Do you have the egg? That's neat. The pram comes with a blaster. Wow. Not that I not that I'm really critical about it, but how many of these how many of these Mando Grogu two packs are we gonna get? Insane. Crazy. Luke Skywalker is still fifty nine ninety nine for this broken pack. Yeah. Okay. I'll pass. Doesn't really say which, how much of this is. Hopefully, maybe I'll take it to the front and find out. Jackson, there's the Paz Vizla. Ooh, there's the Navarro Cantina that uh, for the vintage collection. We saw this at um, EB Games a little while back. So yeah, great set. Don't doesn't have a price right now. Wonder how much it is here. We we'll have to go ask at the front to scan it in. Not bad. Two good finds today. Sweet. Seems to be about it though. All right, let's keep going. Yeah, we're here by the Jurassic Park, which is now Transformers. Doesn't look like there's anything here that's new, and anything here that's affordable. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But there, seriously, thirty-six ninety-nine for Bumblebee. Uh, I just wish it was lower a little bit. I'm gonna have to wait for a sale. One hundred nine for those Ectotrons ones. Never gonna sell. Um, yeah, it seems to be about it. Don't see anything else that's. Uh, we haven't seen here before. We were just here last week. So, yeah. All those Galvatrons. Those Ecto-1s, which are really cool. Family bust together. Yeah. Nothing really standing out. It's pretty much AEW. Yeah, all the exact same things we saw before. Same thing with the Joe section here. I don't see anything else that has come in, which sucks. 
because we should at least have another wave by now. I was really hoping to find Croc Master here. Oh well, I guess we'll have to wait for the next time. All right, guys, let's get going. And up here we still have those Captain Carters, thirty thirty nine ninety nine for these ones. Wow, that actually did up the price a little bit. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, Marvel Shriek, Magneto from the Apocalypse Wave, Morlin, forty two ninety nine. What? Oh my God, just crazy. These prices are insane. Shadow Cat is forty bucks. What? I cannot believe that. What the hell? Why so expensive? Yeah. Like thirty nine ninety nine for Cyclops? Seriously, what's going on here? The Red Hood thirty nine ninety nine thirty four ninety nine for She Hulk thirty six ninety nine for a freaking Eternal? Like what is going on? Oh my gosh, thirty nine ninety nine for like this is actually believe it or not the uh, closer to the original price. These ones are just overshadowing this like crazy right now. Quicksilver. $79.99 for the Hydra Stomper, $66.99 for the Black Widow Red Guardian 2-pack, uh, sorry, the Melina and Red Guardian 2-pack, Black Widow Deluxe, and Modoc. Man, this is getting out, this is getting out of hand. Alright, let's, uh, keep going. Oh, hello! $33.99, that's not a bad price for the Scarlet Witch, check it out, guys. Alright, that's not a great price, but it's not a bad price. I mean, I've seen a lot worse. Thirty-three ninety-nine. I can almost, almost accept. On the classic card too. West Coast Avengers, beautiful stuff. There is the Scarlet Witch, incredible. Now this is um, pretty much the exact same sculpt she had in the uh, All in the Family two pack, three pack. Sorry, but they did change the the facial sculpt just a little bit, and I think that's about it. I think there mm, might be some small differences with the see the pink on her uh, on her outfit. I think it's. Um, a little bit different, but that's about it. Still, she looks great. Awesome stuff. And then we have Loki here. Great to see him. The God of Mischief. Classic comic book Loki. They should put the smiling face on him. I'm sorry. The smiling face is so much better. Right? He looks great. I think he shares Narmer's body. <laughs> that's funny. Ooh. And then just to change things up a little bit, we have Fem Loki. Wow. She looks good. Nice. So she has a name now in uh, in Loki. Don't know if they're the exact same character. I believe they are a little bit different. But good to see them. And is that it? Because it's only Omega Sentinel, Hercules. Yeah. Oh, that's too bad. Oh wait, here's here's Falcon. Nice, awesome, good to see Falcon. If anybody's still still looking for him, Cla nice classic card, awesome stuff. Sweet, great to see Falcon here. We got Lo Lo um, Love and Thunder, Stormbringer, Stormbreaker, sorry, and just a whole bunch of other small Marvel Legends figures. And oh, there he is. Yes. That's it. White Vision, the comic book version, not the um, uh, what's it called um, One Division version from the from the TV series. This is the more traditional comic book version of White Vision. He looks good. He's got his toes. He's got his toes. Sweet. Awesome stuff. Um, Thirty nine ninety nine. Not a bad price for all these figures, right? Because Hercules himself is thirty six ninety nine. So yeah, not a bad price, guys. So if everybody's if anybody's looking for these, they are here at Toys R Us in Pickering. Sweet, that is awesome. All right, guys, Fantastic Four down there. Let's keep going. There are those weird Buzz Lightyear toys. Pixar toys. Sorry. Um, it's kind of interesting, but the ones that really catch my attention are these Bud Light, Buzz Lightyear toys. It's kind of neat. I am interested in seeing the movie. I think it's some sort of like television show inside of the of the toy story universe, which is kind of crazy. But that's interesting to say the least. So, yeah, this could be the start of a brand new thing for Disney. Look at these toys; they're very, very cool. Different sizes, 
different prices. Zerg. Very, very cool. Yep. Definitely see these guys battling it out with each other. Very neat, man. They're pretty well done, too. These were showing up at Winners long before they showed up here at Toys R Us. Crazy. Alright guys, let's keep going. Over here with the Master Universe section, we do see more Fakers, more Triclops, Skele Gods, yeah, Flock Panthors. I'm gonna double check the price on this. This is here $29.99. Gotta find out if that's any different than the price. Land Sharks, Wind Raiders, yeah, Trap Jaws, cool little vehicle here. <clears throat> Savage He Man, Stinkor, Scare Glow, Fisto. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Alright, guys, let's keep going. So there's this mid island here, and it looks like they've got. There's R2D2, and somebody stole a coin, you. Oh, you bastards! Somebody stole a coin, guys. That's not cool, man. That's not cool. Good to see R2, but stolen coin nonetheless. There's Paz Vizsla again, $56.99. Crazy prices. Insane. Gonna have to wait for a sale. Snacking Girl Goo down to $83.97. Again, if you spend anything with uh, mini, you get a mini Lego build for $25 or more before taxes. That's kind of cool. Oh man, all these peg warmers. $11.98 each, $7.98 with certain ones. Crazy. Janna, Luke Skywalker from Yevin, Maskatana, and the two pack. Just really strange. We got Galen Erzo, we got K2SO, $39.99, $37.99. Again, the price thing is just all over the place. $54.99 for Wrecker. Oh, there he is. Yep, Grogu and uh, Mando Money two pack. This one is $56.99. <sighs> just crazy. Short Trooper. $42.99 for the carbonized Scout Trooper and Short Trooper. Again, pricing all over the place. So weird. Alright guys, let's keep... Oh wait, something's over there. Oh, we got the Multiverse of Madness stuff over here. There's the Target exclusive and now Toys R Us exclusive. Defender Strange, $59.99. Definitely going to wait on the sale for that. He does look good. Very, very different from what we know as Doctor Strange. The new trailers are getting crazy right now. $69.99 for the Marvel's Vulture. He's got way more hardware, so that's probably why that is. He's got the shields for some cosplay. There's Loki again. Femme Loki. Scarlet Witch. Hold oh, they got a lot, a lot of good ones here. $33.99 each. Very, very cool. And some Titan Hero series. Oh, Green Goblin. Been while since we've seen him. Oh, they finally got the Iron Man Gauntlet. $179.99. Hoo hoo hoo. That was showing up at uh, GameStop well before. Alright, guys, let's get going. Alright, these didn't have any uh, tags on them, so I'm just gonna do a quick scan, find out how much they are. Alright, here we go. So the Cantina. Ooh, 80 bucks. What the? Fuck? Are you serious? Dang. That is expensive. Holy crap. All right, I'm gonna have to hunt down my toy, my Game Stops to find out, because I'm pretty sure it was a lot cheaper there. And the realistic fur for the Panthor. Let's find out how much he is. Oh, still 64.99. Just not worth it. All right, let's put these guys back. It looks like they got some Super Seven restocks here. This is Reaction Xena Wave One. And here we have Reaction Gabrielle. That one's Xena. And this one is Super 7 Retail Universal Monster Reaction. Nice. They're getting some more, like, Super 7 is really stocking it right now. And Battleship Classics. Sweet. Alright, it looks like they... Uh, wow, Cena. I think it's the first time I've seen her. She's looking awesome. Sweet. It's a full pack of Xena, too. It's not just, like, one or two of them. And then there's Gabriel. Awesome. 
All right, guys. Wow. It was pretty awesome to see all those uh, new figures, especially the uh, classic hearted West Coast Avengers for uh, Scarlet Witch, uh, White Vision, uh, Loki, and uh, Femme Loki. That was freaking awesome. And we did see uh, Falcon there. That was wicked. And we also saw the um, Mando and Grogu 2 pack for the. I call it the Muddy Mando, but uh, it's, it's Avla 7, I think. Yeah, those are awesome. Price is not that awesome, though. That's the only thing. Uh, but what are you going to do, guys? This is the way of the world right now. Anyways, I'm off to the next location, guys. I'll see you there. All right, let's pop into GameStop. Oh, these are pretty cool, actually. I do kind of like it, though. I like having the family. Zelda Bar is down to $15.29. It's not a bad price. Yeah. We got Malfoy, 34, 39. A couple of Dragon Ball Z. I don't know what these are, coasters. Crimes of Grindelwald. It's a bow truckle phone holder. That's neat. Oh wow. Wolverine's down to 20 to 69 now. It's been a while since we've seen that. Not bad. If anybody's looking for that, that's actually they got three of them here. It's not a bad price. No. 15, 20, and 8 for all of the G.I. Joe movie figures. Baroness, Storm Shadow. Ah, no snake eyes though. Cool. Alright guys, check it out. A couple more sale items here. Mm, don't know if that's actually a sale. $26.99 for a Super Mario set. Looks kind of cool though. Oh. Dart. Squeezable dart. Netflix, McFarland Toys, $14.99. Again, not sure that's a sale. Rick and Morty for $13.49. Hmm. Kind of neat. Another Rick and Morty for $11.69. It's a bit of messed up. Oh, what's this? Oh, Jurassic Park. $6.29. Some interesting items here. Yeah, Owen is six twenty nine here too. Neat. They're not bad prices. Eight ninety nine for a Terra Dimorphodon. I do not know what that is. Owen and Baby Blue. That's kind of cool. I will consider that one. Stage magical. <laughs> uh, kind of neat. All right, let's keep going. There's all the pops. Not really that interested in that, of course. I've got a whole bunch of cool Dragon Ball figures. Wow, that's a lot. Holy crap. That is a ton. That's true. This is the most Dragon Ball figures I've seen in one location. Mirrorverse figures, Avatar figures, always awesome. Love this gigantic Aang. If it ever goes on sale, it's mine. Yeah, Tomb Raider, some Biogen stuff. Warhammer 40,000, Cygor. That's one crazy monkey, man. Bloody Violator. A whole bunch of different DC multiverse figures, but nothing I haven't seen before. Ooh, wait a second. That's Clayface. What? Oh my god, he's huge. Holy crap, look at the size of this guy. Like, he is absolutely massive. Look at that. Look at him compared to Batman Beyond. He's gigantic. Holy crap. Looks like one big giant turd. <laughs> very, very cool. Holy crap. Look at the size of my hand compared to this. It's insane. Oh my gosh. Yep. Dark side. Oh, Joker Titan. From the video game. Wow, there. McFarlane's going crazy right now. Look at that. Very, very cool. He's like a transformed mutant joker. That is insane. Holy crap. We also got the movie Riddler here. Oversized. And that movie Batman over there too. Nice. Very cool display pieces. Batman, Batman. Catwoman. 
Yeah, Death Metal Batman, Lexor Power Suit. There he is, Unmasked, Unmasked Batman. That's the one. Crazy. Red Hood, Selina Kyle Unmasked, Nightwing. Yeah, three Jokers, Hazmat Suit, Gold Label, very expensive. Oh, wow, Aquaman. Nice. That looks really cool. Arthur's never looked better. Holy crap. It looks awesome. Neat. Any more? Yep, see, there's a difference. <laughs> Crazy. I think that's it. Too bad. I was hoping for at least a few more of those figures. Probably got it picked up along all the way. Oh, wait a second. Here we go. They're down here. Yep. Dark Detective Batman. Nice. That is very cool. Great to see him. Yep. And here we have Lex Luthor, power suit. Comes with a throne, man. That's crazy. Very, very cool. And here we have, oh, Martian, Martian Manhunter. What? That is awesome. Oh, he looks wicked. Holy crap. Was not expecting to see him today. That is incredible. Can't believe they're all down here. And here we go. Gerald Zod. That's crazy. Holy crap. Very cool to see him here. Beautiful. Yep, and then another Martian Manhunter there. Very cool to see these guys. Well, if anybody's interested in these, they're here at Ajax. GameStop, Stilgar, Witcher, Rivia, Witcher, Geralt of Rivia, Ice Troll. Yep, awesome figures. All right, let's get going. Yeah, let's look at some very cool figures up here. They still have a Titan arc, which is awesome. The Avengers Gauntlet, very, very cool. Star Wars figures. Yep, they got the Mithril. Uh, Moff Gideon carbonized, the armor carbonized, short trooper carbonized, a whole bunch of uh, Imperial short troopers from the archive wave. We do have one Princess Leia, ceremony version, Tech, uh, who's that? That's Quill, and Bodhi, the armor, Crimson Guards, Cal Kestis. Usually they're in order, they're totally not. <laughs> That's okay. Definitely check behind. I'm looking all around. Thanks, appreciate it. Yeah, we got Black Cat, Hercules, Uncanny, Uncanny Axeman Beast. Yep, there are those sail Wolverines, which is awesome. She Hulk, Cersei, yeah, Jen Erzo, Baze Malibus, Night Brother Warrior, Ezra Bridger, which is awesome. Tech, yeah, Imperial Guards. Q90. Hmm. There's a Snake Eyes. Don't know if he's on sale or Scarlet. Don't think so, though. And we have Akiko. Always good to see her. Lady J. Akiko Roadblock. Cool. Here's a Echo Base Rebel Soldier. Very cool to see him here. There's another Quill. Electro Stuff Purge Trooper. And Luminar in Dooley. Vice Admiral Rampart. There's an Incinerator Trooper. That's rare. Hard to see, hard to find those guys. And an Off-World Avla Jawa. Heavy Battle Droid. There's Bodhi. They're all over the place, just like he said. Marvel's Legion. Cyclops. Baron Zemo. Sleepwalker. Cyclops again. Zemo. U.S. Agent. T'Challa Star-Lord from What If. Professor X. Yeah, a little bit of everything. Ooh, there's Ironheart. Nice. We have, we don't see very many of her anymore. Very cool to see her here. Shriek. Flame Trooper, Flame Trooper, Flame Trooper, Flame Trooper. It's a whole freaking battalion of Flame Troopers here. Yep. And Senate Guards. Crazy. Pipes. Always good to see him. And there's Shadow Panther and Waspinator. Pretty cool. Nobody else really. There's the 
Movie Jazz, Magneto. Ooh, there's one we haven't seen before. Check it out. It is Bulkhead. Nice. Good to see him here. It's been a while since we've seen any Legacy Transformers. Nice. Very, very cool. Can't wait until the rest of the line comes in. Still kind of weirded out by the no plastic, though. That is so strange. A whole ton of uh, War Machines. And that Iron Man and Thanos 2-pack. Very cool. Some Turtle Crossovers. Yeah. And lift ticket. Ooh, they still have one of these um, Covert Agent Ravages. I might pick that up. Not today, though. Gotta remember that that's here. Crazy. Snake Eyes and Timber. And all those Ninja Turtle crossovers. Very cool. Ooh, Eye Guy. Nice. Always cool to see Eye Guy. And the Rita and Lord Z2 pack. Pudgy Pig. Shattered Glass. Yeah, pretty much everything. Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Legacy Zarek. Black Zarek. That's crazy. Holy crap. Very, very cool to see this here. $206 for the Edge. Not bad. Not bad. That is a very, very cool Titan class. All right, guys. I think that's it. We should get going. All right, that was cool. All those new DC Multiverse figures, they're awesome. Love that Aquaman. I loved that gigantic freaking Joker. Holy crap. And that Clayface. Just a big turd, man. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm off to the next location. I'll see you guys there. All right, guys. Just over here at Pickering Town Center. I'm going to pop in here and see what they got. Wish me luck. All right, let's head to GameStop. What's this? Holy cow. 139 for this gigantic League of, Le League of Legends cosplay. What the heck is that? That is a big ass sword. Ooh. Neat. That's crazy. Yeah, they had some sort of like animation that came out lately. Very, very cool. Well, if anyone was interested, $125.99 with the edge. Over here at Pickering e GameStop. Yeah, not much else that we haven't seen already. Pretty much all the same stuff from the last time, which was only a couple of weeks ago, actually. Hmm. Okay, I don't know how I missed this. There's Braun. Holy crap. He looks pretty damn good. Oh my gosh. I don't know how I missed that. Crazy. I don't mind this series. It's not bad. 31 90, 49 though. He does seem a little bit light. I'm not gonna lie. But honestly, from the movie, not bad. If anybody's looking for him, we got Braun. Crazy. Alright guys, let's keep going. More of that Disney Mirrorverse. And over here, yeah, pretty much more of the same. Haven't seen anything new come in lately. More of that DC Direct stuff. Oh, there's Aquaman. They are showing up here. Nice. Robin, General Zod, Lex Luthor Power Suit. Be another Lex Luthor power suit, but I guess it's not hasn't arrived yet. Martian Manhunter again. Very cool that these are showing up. There's Clayface. Thing's damn huge. Look at that thing. Freaking massive. Insane. Yep, everything else seems to be the same. Much else to write home about. No more Mo 2 figures either. Okay, wait a second. Oh, a little bit of digging, it does show. Here's that uh, Warhammer 40,000 Tyranid gene, st gene Stealer. Yeah, so that's what it actually looks like colored, eh? Huh. Crazy. Alright. Not bad. All right, let's get out of here. Oh uh, yeah, um, I think I have a five dollar Friday pickup. Perfect. Oh, thank you very much. No worries. Have a good day. You too. 
All right, guys, not much there. There was that brawn, which was actually pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to start collecting the uh, the movie line for uh, Transformers. They do look cool, though, I have to admit. But I guess the next Age of Extinction is going to decide that for me. Anyway, I did pick up Louie from the Disney Afternoon, as well as a Pikachu detective hat. <laughs> All right, guys, let's head back to the lair and see what we got. <laughs> 